Our man Steve Spangler getting ready for his next appearance on Ellen. We love it when you're on Ellen. When they say let's do this, that means that we start to send them uh, experiment ideas and so forth. And, and I've had this propensity to want to crush things. So I want to show you what this demonstration looks like and what we're doing from here. You know, you could just take a can and crush it, but it, it takes so much time and effort. And why would you want to do that when there's a much cooler way to do it? So watch what we've done here. We have a little camping stove and uh, we have some water that's inside the can. So you see how it's boiling away here? So I put a little bit of water. Here's what's happening. When the water boils, it turns from a liquid into a gas and literally pushes all the air out. So watch what happens when we do this. If I put the gloves on, we now have cold water over here. So I'm gonna pick up the can here like this. So watch this. If I pick it up, turn it upside down, watch. Bam! Is that awesome? So now I get this can crushing can kind of effect. Here, watch this. If I turn it upside down, it's the air. Isn't that great? Here, I could do this all day long. Why wouldn't I do this all day long? But Here's what I want you to do. Uh, think bigger, all right? So look at this. This is a 55 gallon drum. See, it's steel 55 gallon drum, and we've been cooking this away. So Jeff, help me out, let's do this. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna turn this off here like this. And uh, again, the object here is that we're cooking uh, the water and turning it from a liquid into a gas. Got it? And now we've got our six here, and he's gonna hook this in. He's gonna tighten it up. So now those molecules went from uh, being a, a liquid into a gas, and now they're gonna wanna go back to a liquid again. We just don't want this to be in the way. So we're gonna hold here like this. Ready, Jeff? Pick it up. And now we're gonna go into the cold water. Do this. So now, you can kinda hear it talking. Do you hear it? It's, it's moving around a little bit. It's cold, but it's a little colder. So here, let me try a little colder. Got it. Good. Doing good. All right, so now, Here's what's happening. Those molecules that were really, really far away are getting closer and closer and closer. And you can hear the can starting to crinkle just a little bit. It's crinkling. It's even talking to you. The hard part is, oh, the hard part is you have no idea what you're doing. Oh, gee. That was a good one. That oh my was God. a good one. Awesome. <laughs> oh, now, my God. Gosh, oh, so I you have no Ellen's idea when it's gonna, gonna happen. Like it just goes, doesn't it? It just goes, and this is what happens when the air pressure is pushing on it. That's the best one I've had all afternoon. We saved it for you. Wow. Look at this, I have, a, I have a graveyard over here. Look at this, poor oh. can, <laughs> poor can. This is my homework assignment. So if you think that I'm not practicing, I really am. Mark and Kim, aren't you glad that we were here in our playroom instead of in the studio oh, and I am. it will look like this? Because I know at this moment, Jeff back there is rethinking all of his career possibilities. <laughs> Everybody is rethinking <laughs> their career possibilities. That was awesome. That so was if you a saw perfect that, one. If you saw that, make sure that you don't tell that we might do this on Ellen, okay? Oh, that's it. just a possibility. And our favorite thing, Kim and I, the thing we love most about when you're on Ellen is how she runs in terror from you. <laughs> I think it'll be good.